Okay, we're going to play Cattle and Crops now. This is a game I haven't played on my stream yet. And I do like to play some farming games, but I've not actually ever streamed anything like this yet. Um, when it comes to farming games, I want it to be as real as I can get it. That, that means that... <sighs> the issue I have with um, Farm Simulator um, is that the fields are flat. They've always been flat. They've been flat for like 10 years now. Um, and they don't seem to want to do anything about making it better. Um, I can understand the difficulties of terrain manipulation and things. But after 10 years of making a game, building up a following getting all of that money you should be able to afford to develop the game beyond a flat field <laughs> it's just i i didn't buy the last game the last farm simulator i threw up um a comment on on their forum that i refuse to buy any more of their games until they actually show forward progression I don't want to be buying the same game I bought two years ago, just flashed up a little bit. It, that's not that's not what I'm. I, I I could get away with buying the six years ago. I could buy buy one of their versions of their game, and that's it. Um, the only difference is they just keep loading it up with farm machinery, and as good as that is, it's it's limited content. So, um, we're going to play Cattle and Crops. Now, I bought this a long time ago. It's been over two years, I think, I've had this. I've watched it through, um, I watched it through Early Access, and it gets, it's got launched today. It got launched today. So, I thought I would have a look at it and see what it, see what they've done for the for the launch now i know i know that um they haven't put more vehicles into the game so what i've got what i'm what i'm gonna get is not it's 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 not there's no multiplayer yet that's something they promised they would do on their kickstarter and it never got it never got implemented whether that's going to happen or not i have no clue i hope it does i would love to play this with other people but if it doesn't, it's it's not a big deal either. Um, let's see. Welcome to Cattle and Crops. As this is the first time you you are here, let's take a few moments to show you what's what. Click or hit escape to go to the next part. Now, it's saying first time I've been here. That's not exactly true. Um, I've been playing this before now, so this thing's probably not going to teach me anything that I don't already know. Okay, becoming a becoming an, a, a, a farmer area is your to go area to learn all the game content and functionality by by tutorials in order to complete certifications. Each pave the way to playing scenarios okay uh, in these in those you can show all your gain skills and knowledge when completing dif different tasks additionally prof professional farm staying companies that's German uh, you you with numeral tips and information from real life agricultural ag ag agriculture okay and last but not least they unlock access to vehicles and other elements in your career well hmm. okay i hope they haven't taken out my little um avoidance right master career games 
can challenge you. Unlock vehicles through scenarios. Increase your reputation to get better fields and expand your company with more animals, which at the moment I think there's only cows. Um, more employees and and grow fleet. Growing fleet. Okay. Uh, or play the sandbox mode without any restrictions for a quick game or just a testing or for testing. Okay, decide your save game which you will want to go, which way you want to go. Okay, switch switch profiles manager for save games or create a new save game from scratch change the active game save game or or load it directly okay uh, mods mod menu provides you with an overview of install mods as well as all standard vehicles and maps activate or deactivate them as you like okay uh, customize your game just the way you like it graphic sound radio stream radio is not going to be on uh, difficulty uh, level controls and more I haven't got a steering wheel yet I would love to have one but getting getting my hands on one over here in the States isn't as easy as I'd like I ordered one my wife ordered actually my wife ordered one and she ordered it under the premise that it was going to work on a PC when it came, it was a it was a, a steering wheel for PS4. So yeah, getting a steering wheel is not easy. And even when I go to the stores, they don't have them. Um, I wish I wish stores would at least carry. Uh, game Game Shop over here had uh, a steering wheel for. Xbox one for PS4 and none for a PC. Which, if you're carrying two, if you're carrying one steering wheel for each platform, at least get one for a freaking PC as well. <clears throat> okay, <laughs> and that's and that's all for the first look. Be sure to check out the tutorials to get to really get into the depths of cattle and crops, and now. Have fun and enjoy playing the game. Thank you very much. Okay. Now, apply knowledge in your career as a farmer and work your way up to grow in your company or sandbox. I'm not going to play this one. This was my um, early access profile. Although it's, it's going to allow me to convert it over. Um, I'm gonna start. I'm gonna start one from scratch. Hmm. Okay. Okay. Company. Logo, they haven't really. Mm, well, they have added some. Ah, <laughs> uh, okay. It has to be that one. It has to be a chicken. And okay, they've added images. Okay, fifty-three of them. Wow. Um. That looks completely random. Oh, that might be the one. Uh, that that's probably going to be the one. <laughs> oh, it might even be that one. Oh, that was nice. That's it's ages since I've seen a sheep. There's not many sheep over here in the US. There is sheep, but I'm I'm guessing I'm living in the wrong spot to actually see them all the time. Wow. <laughs> oh, ace. All right. Um, it's got to be the chicken. I 
It's got to be the chicken. Okay. Let's go. Um. All right. Start. Wow. Okay, this is different. Uh, we're going for a career. Take the challenge uh, and work hard. Unlock the game contents such as large vehicles, fields, uh, or increase your company size. Play uh, complete scenarios and receive XP and unlock the unlock vehicles. Okay, we're going that way. Okay, so currently we it's a new um, wider fields and huge bounty. Um, okay, so there's six, 63 hectares of, and 49 fields. Wow, okay, so um, that's the only one we've got. All right, let's go. I'm assuming that now they've launched it, that they're going to start creating new fields new vehicles and there's not so many vehicles in the game at the moment um which to me it doesn't matter the, the whole point is is it's a farming game you you, you, you a farmer doesn't go and freaking buy a new freaking tractor every every two months um so i can understand why they've, they've, they've limited it like farm simulator it's like there's so many freaking tractors in the game it's just unbelievable um but you wouldn't own all of those on an actual farm and coming from yorkshire where there's a lot of farms um and seeing tractors on the on the on the roads up there you don't see you don't see like 50 different types of tractor in someone's farmyard. I think I, I think most farmers have about maybe two, maybe three different tractors with different power ratings. Um, but that's about it. This is taking a while to load. I wonder why it don't normally take this long. Right, here we go. Come on. Wow, okay. Um, that took a bit. Get to know all the details of your farm. This mission will take you on a guided tour of the more important buildings and functions of your farm. Okay. That's different. Uh, creating the content for the mission. Okay, <laughs> they don't. This is new for me because normally when you start a game, they dropped you in the village and made you walk to find a vehicle. Um, now it's different. Mono, the welcome to your uh, your farm in yes. To find your way around the, your farm, you should know where to find know where to find what uh, we will take we will take a closer look at the different storage facilities of your farm as well as the stable with pastures and your house first off though one important important info you can close windows such as this one either with a with the mouse by activating the mouse in the curse by holding it left oh okay or on the keyboard by control all right so i've got to hold for me to get my mouse to work i've got to hold left left control yet yeah, which which some of the operations of the vehicle you have to do that anyway all right go to the pasture Oh, let me chip stuff here. How bad are they? What are they? They've got... Wow, okay. Let's drop that a little bit. That's that's just crazy. Uh, 
no wonder it took ages for that freaking map to load as much as as much as I would love to have it on ultra um, my computer just really can't handle that okay we've got music off okay right oh okay let's let's wow okay go to the pasture which is okay do we have any cows huh they've taken away all the cows hmm we don't have any cows this is your pasture if it offers a lot of space for your bulls and there is also enough grass to eat if the weather is fine you can bring your animals from the stables to the pasture um, let, let's have a look at the stables let's have a look at the stables next time okay so we're going to the stables right okay so we can actually hold our cows in this field hmm. I always had them I always left them in the barn but um, this is the bullpen here you can put your bulls neither to provide them with uh, either to provide neither un yeah to provide them with daily food rations you will find the transport box on the what oh transport yeah um, on the right of the entrance the box is used to load and unload animals with the trailer from there you can distribute them to nine other boxes each box can accommodate up to five bulls in front of each barn you will also find the feeding chute which you can fill with feed mixture next we will go behind the okay yeah I'm going behind so that's um, okay so wow all right okay that door never used to work to your right uh, is the liquid fertilizer tank for your farm here you can store um, with your liquid fertilizer or water to your left is the slurry pump of the barn okay Go to the slurry pump. The slurry bunker is located under the barn. All the slurry can produced by our cows in the barn ends up in the slurry bunker and can be taken uh, taken out of here with a slurry barrel via the slurry pump. <laughs> you can then use the slurry to fertilize your fields right okay uh go to the seed pellet seed pellets seed pallets okay um okay these are your seed pallets you here you can store s surplus seed in your in your in case you have brought too much all right later on you can take it out with the seed drill from these pallets from here to plant 
in your farmer fields. Now let's see what is on the other side of your farm. Okay. So how do these pallets work? I've, I didn't use these before. So I, I hope they show me how these work. Alright, over here. Um, go to the silos. Uh, here you can see the two silos of your farm. Use these to, ex for example, store silage or cut maize to have enough food for winter. All right. You can monitor the current status of the silos by using two control the two control units in front of you of them. Okay, that's I've done that before. Okay, so now where's it going? Uh, storage, drain storage, grain storage. Wow. Okay. Um, this is grain storage in in the ground. You, you will find the. You will find immediately immediate storage where you can dump your grain with your tr with the trailer. From there, the grain is transported with the help of a blower to a sto to storage in the storage on the upper floor above the gray grid. There is, there is a loading pipe. Okay. Wow. Okay. Um, there's a loading pipe which you can use to fill your trailer with grain from the storage. Let's see what it looks like in the warehouse upstairs. Upstairs, the the stairs will take you to individual storages okay wow okay this is new too oh my god as you can see you have a total of 10 individual storage boxes at your disposal they fit approximately 45,000 litres each. That makes a total of 450,000 hang on, 450,000 litres. Okay. Uh, storage capacity. The storage is especially useful when prices are usually about to go down then you can store the grain temporarily until you get better prices next let's see how you, how you can best supply your machines wow All right. Gas farm gas station. Here, here is the farm gas station. Here you can always refuel your vehicle fleet. If you run out of fuel, the town can. If you run out of fuel, fuel near the town, you can also fill up a gas station there. All right. Water pressure. That's washing the washing the vehicle. Yeah, high pressure thing cleans dirt off. Hang on. You can use a clean clean your vehicle after a day in the dirt. The store. To store your vehicle after, through clean cleaning, there are several shelters and halls around the farm. Okay. 
go to the machine hall. <clears throat> this hall you can you have plenty of space to accommodate most of your machinery machines vehicles that you want to have ready for use often quick quickly can hang on you have ready for use often and quickly can of course also be parked under one of the shed shelters in the yard if you do not have enough space here you can also park some vehicles in the workshop of your farm building You can also park in the workshop, though the door on the right side of the workshop will enter the garage where you can park small vehicles. Uh, last but not least, let's head back to your house. Um, I wonder if they're actually planning on... Um, I'm wondering if they're actually planning on uh, <clears throat> having you be able to work on your on your vehicles from here. Go into your house. All right. Um, at your desk you will find your computer the computer has the fertilizer calculator installed which you can use to calculate an optimal application rate of your fields you will learn how this works in tutorials after a hard day's work you can also go to sleep in your house yeah we've done that before well, I have anyway so this thing okay huh all right sleep okay sleep <laughs> welcome to to the farm this is all you need to know about your farm it is best to look around a little more to familiar yourself with everything if you still have questions about the game mechanics take a look at the tutorials and become a farmer look at take a look at the tutorials in the becoming a farmer menu okay all right so progress done 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 did you give me money you gave me some money why is it still dark we only slept till eight o'clock at night <laughs> um seriously it's why does it have you do that? That's ridiculous. All right, let's sleep. Let's work out what we need to sleep. Maybe at least it puts lights on for you when you go in places. Um, sleep. If it's eight, ten hours, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, one, two, three, four, five, six. That'll be that'll be enough. Six o'clock, roughly, yeah. All right, so tutorials. Now let's check out. All right, we've got level one. Why did it 
I didn't pick that as a picture. Ah, I picked a chicken. All right. Um. Right. Okay. That must. She. They must be twins. <laughs> um. Let's see. Vehicles. Pretty much. Pretty much the same things as I'm, I've seen before. All right. So we need to get available quests. Um, why isn't it showing me anything? Oh, here we go. Why? Why? That's not. That's completed. Okay, so why aren't you giving me any quests? Um, wow, okay, so the map. No different. Do I actually even own any of these fields? Let me see what... Fields. Um... Owned. Oh, I don't own anything. What the heck? So, okay. Um, uh, tasks. Oh, quest and uh, tasks. Nothing. Map. Tasks, quests, calendar, um, wow, uh, This isn't working out very well right now, is it? Um, because I am not getting any quests at all. Okay, completed, completed, that's completed. Right, so we've done that one. Why aren't you giving me anything else? Starry available. Okay. Hmm. Well, that kind of sucks. Cause like I would have expected it to have given me another another quest, and. It hasn't given me any money whatsoever. Um, great. German. Okay, definitely German. Huh. Auto lights. So, is it the most? Is it, there might be a, there might be um, something I'm missing here. Uh, making a beginning. Um. There was a field of the back here. Wow, they really diff they really changed the gr the way the graphics look on this. That sunrise is just unreal. Uh, yeah. 
That definitely definitely looks pretty good. Not sure how but how much of a, a a flare that would get in real but anyway. Um I have apps hang on. Hang on, let's see what this is. See if this actually achievement more exercise. Okay. And um received XP for walking one kilometer. Okay. Um <laughs> Wow. They have changed this to a point where I don't know whether I'm gonna like it or not. So do I have to do the tutorials? Maybe. I've done that. Machines. Is that is this gonna get me what I need to get started? Okay. Guess. Certifications are, com are comprised of a group of tutorials for different categories. They share a common topic and allow you to learn direct functions and features necessary to advance game for advanced gameplay. Complete certifications to unlock all scenarios. All right. Okay. All right. So. I'm basically thinking I have to do these these tutorials to get my stuff. Maybe let's let's do the tutorials, I guess. That's kind of naff, though, that it doesn't go from "Hello, this is your farm." Here's five. It is quarter of a million euros. Uh, you don't have any fields. And you don't have no vehicles to work with, but here's your farm. <laughs> as much as I, I do like this game, um, the game designers didn't really think how to how to progress the game from one stage to the next. Okay, welcome to the first tutorial. Let's start with. Uh, the ba absolute basics again, really. I've already gone through that. We've just walked around the farm. This shouldn't be a quest. <laughs> move forward, move forward, move backwards, go left, go right, okay. Um, run to point. Okay, we ran, ran to target. Oh man! Go to pasture. Well, we're definitely getting our exercise. Can we have some cows, please? Oh, there is a cow. What? Hello, dude. Change camera perspective. Yeah, I still look like an old dude. Entice the bull by pressing J. Wow. Okay. Chase it by pressing H. Go to the barn. Hmm. Wow. There, that's new features. Didn't know you could do that. Alright, flashlight, F, go to field 14, okay, is this, is this our first field, hold, hold down the button shown, halt, okay, 
for to see field info window which shows which 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 shows you the volume and moisture of the wind window windrows of grass this will be useful later when it comes to drying the grass okay so um, we're looking at moisture content um, it's 71% to 78% wet so it's pretty wet okay All right, so confirm to continue. Okay, these were the basic controls in cattle and crops. Tutorial will end. Okay, so end. Um, step one complete. All right. <coughs> Um, may as well finish the whole thing out right if we're doing certification we may as well complete the whole thing before we move on to the machines I'm hoping at the end of all of this that it actually gives us some some more stuff to play with in our farm because like that didn't give us any End of the end of the tutorial at the beginning didn't give us nothing. Open control info. The controls. The control info will display most of the actions you can use at the moment it shows different available actions depending on your situation okay wow that was a bit jerky uh, activate mouse control forward back left right run Oh, full throttle, vehicle, next vehicle, uh, attracting it and, and scare off animals, okay. Open the map with display button. It will display where you are in the world and the possible points of interest such as track traders and f your farm as well as positions of your vehicles the fields you own and the colored you own are colored in green <coughs> you can you can see a large version by pressing m okay all right so we own one, two, three, four, five, six fields. You can use the cursor to set waypoints. If you if you select a field on the map, the field menu will open with the field with field open where you can see the field details. Okay. Hmm. I see. Flowers map. Huh, got a little bit of cash. 
increase speed why you can increase speed by using plus all right when you when you're in one time speed sleep button will open sleep window you will be allowed to sleep to fast forward up to a hundred days in the future wow okay set forward amount by 10 days and three hours Wow. <laughs> it's raining. Click the weather button. Weather icon shows current weather. Click it. Opens calendar with weather free views. Close calendar. This shows weather previews following the next seven days. So we've got. Where are we? I think it is. Ah, yeah, it is this one. Okay. So it's going to rain. It's going to rain, it's going to be a bit sunny, it's going to rain, it's going to be a little bit sunny in the afternoon. So, it's going to be pretty naff for the next seven days. <laughs> Apart from then, that will be the good time to do any, um... oh hang on. Wow, okay. This money selection shows your current account balance. Click and see the finances. Okay. Close. We are pretty broke. We have absolutely nothing. Okay. That was a bit weird. When in a vehicle, in or out of view, you find the speedometer in the bottom right corner in addition your speed rpm it also displays the current gear fuel usage as well as situation dependent status icon whatever that is all right When in a vehicle with any cargo, such as trailer with thrash fruit, you'll see a cargo status bar. Above the speedometer, listing all contents in the tanks. Okay, so... So the back one, the one furthest away must be the top, top one because that's, that doesn't look like, 
the back one looks like it's got the less amount in so it must be barley in the back one and wheat in the front one or the closest one to us all right complete into wow these tutorials are going to go on forever we've got another one of those and then we're on to machines wow Right, let's get this basic stuff out of the way. This is, um, I think it's a little over the top on the tutorial side of things. Um, not sure how much uh, uh, why why there's so many th three basic ones and that last one really wasn't any good in this tutorial you will get to know the game menus and fun and its functions the menus not only provide an overview of your vehicle animals employees tank levels and market prices you'll they'll they are also place places to go for buying and selling okay so we've got a cow transporter um is that all we've got stop buddy stop buddy why the heck does it give us a cow transporter and i can't even see a tractor anywhere why <laughs> that is just i we looked at hang on let's look in here there's nothing in there right and there's nothing in this one because we just looked and we shouldn't okay I'm just curious, right, of, we're on a basic tutorial, and it drops a cow transporter, it's also given us a million in money, which, I don't know whether we're going to get to hold on to that, alright, um, buying and selling, so press F1, okay, uh, you, you've opened, the vehicle menu this gives you the overview of the machines available from the trader you can also manage your vehicle fleet in this trader view you can buy vehicles and implements or rent them for a period of time yes select tractor menu uh, tractors uh, select engine power filter sort I we sort him okay uh, yeah select this vehicle and buy it okay look at the fleet here you see your vehicle, all your own vehicles. Great. <laughs> I don't want to sell it. Sell your vehicle. <laughs> oh my god. Go to animals. Stock. Select the cow. The right panel shows the wealth of wealth of information about the animal, e.g., its age, weight, and barn. Information, inf more detailed information about the function can be found in animal transport tutorials. Okay. Wow. Okay. 
employees. Here, here you have an overview of job, current job market, i.e. workers you can hire and your own staff. Okay, hire her, staff, select her, dismiss her, whoa, okay, bank, new loan, here you have specific size of your loan you want, no, over how long you want to pay it back, okay, take a loan, Switch the two time going to pay the okay. Overview of stocks traded left left shows the, the your show left side left hand side shows your storage, right hand side shows various traders. Okay. And how much you're buying for. Okay. Uh, planning is everything. In this menu, you will see over all current and planned tasks. You can also create new tasks here for your your employees. In free mode, you will also get a list of available and ongoing missions in the quest section. See tutorials in helper category details. Okay. Buy field owned. Okay. Achievements. Right, your achievements show here, your goal of course should be to get as many gold ones as possible. Alright. Close the menus. Okay, and tutorial, wow. Disc roll. Main menu. Um, tutorials, certified scenarios. Why aren't we getting any? Oh. Okay. So next one is machines. Interface is done. Ah, okay. So I think this gets me to field work and then sewing, fertilization. Wow, 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 wow. Okay, wow. <laughs> um, next then. <laughs> 